When thinking about a compressed air system, the first thing that comes to mind is a compressor. But what else goes into your system? The typical clean, dry air system includes a compressor, a wet air receiver, coalescing pre-filter, regenerative air dryer, particulate air filter, dry air receiver, and sometimes even a final filter before the piping takes the compressed air to the final application. Receivers are used to store compressed air and limit demand on the compressor. Dryers and filters are used to reduce moisture content and contaminants in the air system. Compressors produce a large amount of waste heat, so keep that in mind when designing your compressor room. You will need a source of clean inlet air, discharge air ducting, or consider a water-cooled machine. If you're interested in saving on energy costs, you can implement a heat recovery system. If your system requires backup or additional capacity, you will have more than one compressor connected to your system. These can be set up to communicate direct through auto lead lag or another sequencer when connecting three or more compressors. This communication allows compressors to be turned on only as needed.